The beautiful island of Samoa, population 200,000, and 42% of them are members of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. That's why the island was abuzz to welcome the arrival of President Russell M. Nelson to town, the first president of their church to come to Samoa in 14 years. Thousands of members lined the streets for 17 miles just to see him. We know that it's like so, it's such a blessing for Samoa to witness his uh, first time here in Samoa. President Nelson's first stop was a visit with the head of state. His Highness told us he was honored to have him come to his home. We noticed that the Church of, the, of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints is uh, doing a marvelous job in uh, the social welfare system, in the schooling, yeah, and uh, great organization. A short time later, thousands gathered in a huge field just next to the temple to hear President Nelson's message of hope and encouragement and a reminder to prepare for difficult times ahead. The Apostle Paul taught this lesson in 2 Timothy chapter 3. In the last days, perilous times will come that we have a solemn duty to prepare our people for the difficult days that lie ahead. A day of joy and faith, their prophet had come, even if it was for just one day. I love the people of Samoa and they love the church, they love the Lord. 